This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Mid-American Energy says it's currently meeting customer demand with the extreme cold. Mid-American operates a different portion of the electric grid that is not experiencing the same challenges as other electric systems. The company says it remains capable of serving all its customer load without interruption, but they are asking customers to try and limit their use of electric and natural gas. And the cold is taking a toll on fuel supplies across the Midwest. Gas here in Omaha has gone up and Iowa's governor is trying to make sure there's plenty of heating fuel to keep the state warm. Governor Kim Reynolds signed a proclamation which will make it easier to transport those fuels across the state. The relaxed rules allow drivers hauling propane, diesel and natural gas to temporarily work longer and haul larger loads. The fuel transport rule change will last until March 17th. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swain, four below zero as we head into early Wednesday morning. So not as cold as where we've been, but still cold. Spotty snow feels like temperatures 15 to 10 degrees below zero as we head into early Wednesday morning. The high for Wednesday back into the double digits and at that, the teens. Again, some spotty snow possible, not as cold. It won't amount to much. We'll just see a few flurries. Another chance again Wednesday into Thursday for some spotty snow. Teens the next couple of days, then the 20s, then the 30s by the weekend. Back above freezing, the potential is there on Sunday. It could come with another round of light snow. 40 by Monday and 41 on Tuesday. It does get better. Get a large one topping pizza for only 13 bucks when you buy two. All the favorites. You choose just two for 26. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.